Bitch the bitch. Are you okay? It, it's been so long since I was here. I used to love this place. But it's so overgrown. I'll be fine. Let's just find a way in. Okay. Why would they make a big deal about a collectible? Wild boar. Not too many in these parts, but they were more common where I grew up. I used to hunt them with my old man when I was little. They make terrible noises when they die. <laughs> I like it. It'll look good on my wall. Clem's claiming that. Mine, she says. I can't see shit. Well, there's too much condensation on the inside. Condensation? That's a big word for you. Shut up. Big pockets, indeed. What do you want? Uh, nothing. You're only here because we're desperate, you know. So don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are going to have words. Let's survive first. <laughs> Yeah, like you can totally tell she's got that boar head in her back pocket, right? Was it her left butt cheek or her right butt cheek that she shoved that thing in? That window. I bet we can get in there. Good spot. Mitch, come here and give me a boost. Wait. Make her go first. We send the one we don't mind losing. Wow, That's Mitch. That's an ugly thing to say. Vice says we need her help, right? She shouldn't mind sticking her neck out. Yeah. You know what? Fuck you. Yeah, Mitch. Oh, stop it. Both of you. Let's just get the stuff we need, okay? Go in. Are they gonna, like, just make out or something? Because this tension's kind of, like, angsty here. I'll holler if one grabs you. Otherwise, we'll come as soon as you get the all clear. Mitch and Clementine are gonna... Door opens. Pretend to make babies or something? Like, what's going on here? Is this love? Are they in love now? Shit. Grab the frickin' knife, Clem. Go, 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 go. You know, trauma makes the heart grow fonder. I'm fine. Oh, thank God. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Bitchy Mitchy. <laughs> no. Are you saying that's not love? God, you guys are so lame. They're coming. Clem kicked I ass. Get the door open. You're welcome. Yeah, I know, right? Three walkers makes us overwhelmed. Overrun. Not bad. Oh, look. Wild ginger. Eastern prickly pear. Jerusalem artichoke. False Solomon seal. Huh. Let's find that barbed wire and anything else that might be useful. It's all useful, Mitch. It's called plants. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These herbs are going to do wonders for morale. Yeah, exactly. You wait and see. Uh, anytime you want to. Thank us for kicking ass. Some mushrooms are edible. Probably not edible. Mysterious mushroom? Could be a weapon. Or use it to dig a grave. You weren't there when we dug the holes for Marlin and Brody. We had to use cups and bowls. It took forever. 
Like, I'm sad about Brody, obviously, because Mitch beat the shit out of her. Am I sad about Marlon? No, not at all. Gotta find out somehow. Time to have some fun, guys. Find something? Yep, maybe useful. Good for digging. Yes! Dibs! Ooh, 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 ooh! <clears throat> Dibs? Oh, yeah. Ho, 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 ho! Throw that in her left cheek back pocket. So we have a boar skull in her right butt cheek and a crowbar in her left butt cheek. Oh, yeah! We be packing heat here. Before they came up with the name Trow, you think they called them mini shovels? Probably. Pry bar? Get out of here with your pry bar. It's a sexy crowbar. Oh, put it to work. Good lord, that's a great weapon. Slash tool. Barbed wire. A lot of it, too. That should keep the raiders from climbing our walls. Hey, we can use these. For what? Bombs. We can make bombs out of these. Bombs? Are you serious? Totally. NFO. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. I just need some propane and something to create a spark. And we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade explosive. Mm-hmm. Cool, cool, cool. Did you find anything? What do you think? Okay, just asking. Ten. You know, the barbed wire idea is smart, I'll give you that. Those assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. I kind of like to see that. Okay, why are we getting all flirty here there, Jamie? She has an endless inventory like Nancy Drew? Sure does. Eat it, eat it, eat it. We're gonna eat it. Yeah. Oh, come on, clam. Ugh. What? This was for science. <laughs> hey, that's my line. For science. You could, like, use it to grow more plants. Psh, we need to make some bombs. Okay, is there anything else we need to do in here? A lab? What the hell is a lab? I remember right, there's a science lab through that door. Maybe there's propane in there. Come on, help me move this thing. Science rules? I agree. You know what I also agree with? Ladies drool. Got a bunch of crap in there for okay, sure. Let's see what's inside. Yeah, let me do it. I'm the brave one. Ladies drool. Have you not heard that? We had a scare, that's all. Careful, Gibbs. Careful with the male power. Oh, what is she looking at? What? Who's that lady? Who was she? Miss Martin. Our nurse at the school. She stayed. Oh, that's terrible. God. 
She looks... Pretty? Sexy? Hot? You can barely recognize her. She's just... just like all the others. I'm sorry, Ruby. I... I just... wish I could make her look like she used to. Our relationships with One Ruby's day we chain. came out looking for food. The walkers attacked us. Thought we could fight them off, but there were just... <laughs> there were so many. Ms. Martin told us to run. So we did. She taught me how to patch people up. Stitching, local anesthetics, painkillers, fever reducers. Aww, I don't think I can. Ruby. Take care of her. Would you? I'm sorry. Absolutely. Poor Ruby. Looks like me at work? What kind of work do you do? Ooh, her suffering is now over. Oh, damn. Are you okay? Yeah. Just need a minute. Come on, guys. Help me find that propane and we can get out of here. We got some chemistry on the wall. What do we have? What do we see? Rip Miss Nursey? Yeah. H2SIO3. The hell are we looking at here? H2C double bonded with CHCH3. Hmm. We got gold and silver. Why the hell is that on this board? <laughs> Clem will eat, smell, touch anything. She's not afraid. I don't believe that you look like that at work, Stephanie. I think you look you just find anything? fine. I actually, I don't know what this is. It's blue goop. What is the scientific equation for love? Oh God. I bet you it exists though. That's cool. For science. Beautiful and deadly. That's how I like them. Beautiful and Ugh, deadly. Looks like piss. Dare you to drink it. Not in a million years. Wimp. T okay. How about you drink a random chemical, dude, bro? Uh, Mitch, is this useful? Fucking A. I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. Hmm. Now we just have to find propane. We can blast those motherfuckers to hell. Oh, I'm having wicked deja vu. Did you ever have one of those? You had to like press down and go click, click, click to light the Bunsen burner. That's what you needed for the Bunsen burner. <sighs> Let's hope there's gas in it. I use those in my jewelry class. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, perfect. Here. Fine. Now we have everything we need. We should get back and tell the others. We have to bury Ms. Martin first. Bury her? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. We can burn it. No. Ms. Martin's the reason we're all alive. And? She deserves a proper burial. Here. Next to the greenhouse she loved. That way the others won't have to see her like this. She's been dead for years. There's no point. Nah, I think we bury her. She deserves a real burial. I'll help you bury her. It's the right thing to do for someone you cared about. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. It's not a her. It's a walker. Fine. Whatever. 
I'm not wasting my energy on that thing. Okay, Mitch the bitch. Fine, you do you, bro. I'll put a stone in the graveyard. Back at the school. Bet Ms. Martin loved this place. She'll be happy here. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped me. That you've got a... a good heart. Under all that muck. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, when was the last time Clementine showered? You stinky. Think it'll be enough? Hopefully. And it means Lily and her people won't be able to climb the walls. They'll have to come through the gates. We can plan for that. Straight into a fiery explosion of death. Assholes won't know what hit them. Kids, so naive. The adults are gonna come in and just like shoot the shit out of the place. Kids. Oh, he's alive still. Well, that's nice. Brought you these. I noticed his shirt got messed up when, you know. Where did you get those? They were tens back when he got here. Should be about AJ's size. How's he doing? Better. His fever's down. Thank you for carrying him in. No problem. So we've got a greenhouse again and bombs. Mitch's idea. I figured. Violet says we'll start getting this place ready in the morning. Good. They all seem okay with letting you stay. You're not? For now, anyway. While we get ready to fight. Yeah, I'm glad. All I've wanted is for them to forgive us. I said they're fine with you being here, at least till the raiders are gone. That doesn't mean they all like you again. Everyone else is okay with us staying. What about you? It's fine. Well, he gets better. And after that? I don't know, Clementine. Clem? Hey, kiddo. How do you feel? Better. Still hurts. I know. Ow. Hi, Louis. Hey, little dude. I missed you. Are we friends again? Yeah, Lewis, are we friends again or what? Just get some sleep, okay? Don't dodge the question, mister. Get back here. Lewis? Lewis! I really missed you. Missed you too. Good night. I'm not mad at him anymore. <laughs> he helped carry me. And he was by my bunk when Ruby gave me stuff. AJ, I was never mad at him. I understand why he acted that way. Why he wanted us gone. I don't. I was right. I know, kiddo. <laughs> People are complicated. <laughs> Let's get a look at the shirts Lewis brought you. Then we'll sleep. It's been a long day. Yeah. No bullet holes in the shirt? James was nice. But I don't like sleeping on the ground. Me neither. Let's pick out a new shirt. Let's see what we got. Disco Broccoli. Hey, look. It's Disco Broccoli and his friend. I wish you could have seen this cartoon. <laughs> Me too. Disco Broccoli. Hey, this one's pretty cool. Mm, looks like Marlin's jacket. Oh, yeah. But it would still look good on you. How about this one? It looks like Tin's boots. Oh yeah, I think it's the same character. Cool. Okay, well which one are you picking, bro? I think we have to go Disco Broccoli. I mean, it's Disco and Broccoli. Hmm, this one will work. You can put it on when you feel better, okay? Yeah. Time for sleep. I can't sleep with the light. I'll blow it out in a second. So we have a bunch of stuff. Okay, place the fly trap. 
That's cool. Where's our little skull going that's in our other ass cheek pocket? Um, over here, maybe. Mushroom. Okay, cool, cool. I wonder how long it'll last. It'll be a fun guy. She has that in her pocket. <laughs> Look at the size of nice. that thing. That thing's a monster. Peaches and shrooms. That is a great combination, don't you think? Okay, I think we are ready to take a little sleep here. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if it tries, <sighs> bang. Bang. You know, I don't know if I ever really was into peaches, but I feel like in the last few months, I've learned to really enjoy a peach. I don't know how to explain that. Bonk. Don't bonk your head on the uh, bunk beds. More wind. Oh, time is going back by fast, is it? Hey, you put on the shirt. Peaches, peaches, peaches. I love you. Peaches are really juicy, depending on where you, when you get them or where you get them. Mm. I love donut peaches. I'm not familiar with donut peaches. I'm willing to try, though. Georgia peaches and peach yogurt? Why are we hearing a baby crying? Change it, feed it. What the f hell's with the horse? Clem, did you eat that mushroom last night? Not another watermelon. Eating like rabbits in here. Yeah, I feel like she actually maybe have had that mushroom and now she's, you know, dealing with it. Hey, Jay. Jennifer, welcome in. How are you? A very magic mushroom. Oh my god, the horse! Like, I know my dreams are kind of messed up, but... Ew. This can't be good. Oh my god, the horse! Just turned into PT. <laughs> ah, I don't want to open the door. The crying is rough. Your maternal instincts start to kick in. You know what I mean? You were having a nightmare. Same one you used to have all the time. How does he know? 
about what happened at the ranch. I'll be okay. Mm. Just give me a minute. Hey, what do you have there? Did you have a bad dream too? You've been having them a lot lately. I feel safer like this, not sleeping. I want to stay up forever. I probably could. Like 18 days, if I tried hard. I've never seen that knife before. Did you make it? When? I don't know, while you were busy. It must have taken days. I couldn't stop thinking about it until I made it. Ah! Here, let me help you back to bed. No. You don't have to keep checking on me. You always say, be tough. So I am. You say, be strong. And I will. All the time. You're the toughest boy I know. Probably the toughest boy in the whole world. Not as tough as you. Aww. Well, no one's as tough as me. Yeah, right. <laughs> I don't have maternal instincts. What instincts do you have? Watermelon instincts? I'm sorry you had to do all the hard work. Showing them I'm good and smart. Smarter than them. I'm gonna help you more, so you don't have to do everything. Where are you going? On patrol. Patrol? For danger. Bad people. Monsters. Whatever you have nightmares about. What if you stayed here instead? If you go back to sleep, I'll stay awake and make sure no more bad dreams come. You can't do that. You're not magic. <laughs> How do you know? Maybe I have magic and never told you. <laughs> no, you don't. What is it? Can I... Could I maybe sleep in your bed? Like I did when I was little? Yeah, come on up. I'm not scared, just tired. Mm -hmm. Makes sense to me. Mm -hmm. Think you need that? <laughs> AJ? What? You're still little. Yeah, I know. Last time you saw AJ, he was barely walking? Well, he's grown up into being a cold stone killer. I only have cat instincts. What about the doggos? You have instincts for doggos? <sighs> you ready to work today, kiddo? Bad dreams always make me more tired. Me too. I slept better in your bed. It's my turn to be lookout. I have other stuff I need to do. What stuff? Nothing. It's just... It's important. God damn it, Lewis. Take this seriously for once in your life. I've been taking this seriously for fucking days. Almost two weeks. So has everyone. Get over yourself. Doggos, too. There you go. Hey. I thought mm. Lily and Abel would show up days ago. I wonder why they're holding off. Don't know. All I wanted was more time to prepare, but now this waiting sucks and everyone's on edge. Need my help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on everyone and make sure they're doing shit right? Sure, I'm on it. Thanks, Clem. I should go board up the back hallway since Lewis isn't gonna do it. So basically, you like babies for everything but humans is kind of what I'm hearing. Which, you know, hey, it is what it is.